Okay, in today's video, I'm going to go over what is a farad. And a farad is this. A farad is the derived unit of capacitance in the metric system. When we measure the capacitance of a capacitor, we measure that capacitance in farads. And if you have a one farad capacitor, then it can store one coulomb of charge when it is attached to a one volt source. So one farad is one coulomb per volt, and we can write that simply like this. That one farad is equal to a charge of one coulomb per volt. Now, the abbreviation for farad is simply F. Okay, that's the abbreviation for the unit. Now, when we talk about farads, we're often talking about capacitance. I just want to mention that the equation symbol for the capacitance, or for capacitance, is a C. And you can see that here in this equation that you may be familiar with. This is Q equals C times V. This is the charge, which is measured in coulombs. This is the capacitance, which is measured in farads. That's the units for capacitance. And this is the volt, which is measured in volts, or the spannung, which is measured in volts. Okay, Q equals C times V. C is capacitance. Capacitance is measured in farads. And we could write that down. For example, if we have a capacitor, we could have a capacitor that has a capacitance of 470 microfarads. Oftentimes, although these days it's not that uncommon, but oftentimes when you go to the store and you buy a capacitor, it has a capacitance of less than a farad. In this case, it's microfarads. Now, here are some capacitors, and you can see there are different capacitors here. This capacitor has a capacitance of 3,300 microfarads. This is a 100 microfarad capacitor. This is a 470 microfarad. So a lot of times you see them like this there. This one looks like it's probably also 470 microfarad. This one is 10, okay? So usually you don't go to the store and you get a one, capa a one farad capacitor, although you can get them. They're not that uncommon these days. Okay, um, let's see. Or you can maybe, yeah, okay, okay, let's go on. Okay, the units. Like I said, most of the times it's less than a farad. So we can have a microfarad capacitor. Microfarad is abbreviated. This is micro. This is mu, the Greek letter mu. This is the symbol we use for micro. This is how we write microfarad. Microfarad is 10 to the minus 6. We could have, for example, the capacitance of a capacitor could be 220 microfarads, which we could write that also as the capacitance is 220 times 10 to the minus 6 farads. These two values are equivalent to each other microfarads, 10 to the minus 6 farads, the same thing. We could also have nanofarads, which is 10 to the minus 9, and you could also have picofarads. I think those are kind of the most common capacitors that you'll run into. I think micro is the most common, but you'll also see maybe in your calculations or in your problems, nanos and picofarads. Okay? So that's really it. I just want to point out that farads are the basic unit. It's not really basic. It's a derived unit for uh, the capacitance uh, in the metric system. Okay, thank you very much for watching. I hope you found that video helpful. If you did, please do all the following three things. You can subscribe to my channel, leave me a nice positive comment in the comment section below, and give me a thumbs up for this video. Thank you very much. We'll see you in the next video.